our film starts with a failed operation in Budapest. Because of this failure, the head of the MI6 is fired and associated with him, his closest man, George Smiley, our main character. A man should know when to leave the party. MI6, which is also known as the circus, is an in-name given, really, for the intelligence service. And something's going on in MI6 now. There is a mole right at the top of British intelligence. He's been there for years. So they try to persuade George Smiley to get back in to find out who this mole might be. I'm retired, Oliver. It does mean you're rather well placed outside the family to look into this matter for us now, doesn't it? I'll do my utmost. In this world, it's all something's jargon for something. And there are four high-ranking intelligence officers that are under suspicion. And it is Tinker. Alalon. What's that shrug for? He is that very dangerous reforming spirit who appears to be without caution. Don't damn well shrug at me. Taylor Hayden. Mr. Hayden, not now. He has that somewhat maverick quality. It's a kind of dashing, rather cavalier desire to do things perhaps not quite according to the rules. Soldier Bland. 25 years we've been the only thing standing between Moscow and the Third Bloody World War. He's quite gifted, he's well read, and therefore he's a watcher. And then poor man, Esterhaus. He has the uh, ability to always go with who he thinks will be the leader. What's this about, George? It's about which master you've been serving, Toby. But of course, every character in this film is potentially both a pawn and a knight. 